Please feel free to use me. <sighs> okay. Well, hello there, Internet, and welcome to episode 8 of my playthrough of The Observer. I got bad news for you. I did record two episodes since the last one, but somehow my recording software was messing up. I couldn't open the, the, the file. It didn't work in my rendering software. And that's why we're here on the second floor. Now, what happened? If you remember, we escaped that weird laboratory thing, that chop shop in the last episode and ended up in the basement. Down in the basement, there were some creepy things happening. There were some uh, animal noises and I found a locked door, a locked door to a part to the basement unit 28. I couldn't open the door because it had a keypad. So what I did, I was checking the database back in Anus's office and I figured out that the unit, fuck off bird, belonged to the guy living in this apartment in 205. Why can't I open the door? There we go. How do I crouch again? There we go. We looked around a bit and upon opening these doors we figured out that he's creating and selling organs on the black market. Look at that. He gets human skin. I think there was a liver and a heart in there. Dang it. Yeah, there's a human liver. There's a human heart. Fuck knows what that is. I didn't check it, I think. Dang it. How do I check it again? There we go. It's a biomass. Composed of water, fat, protein, collagen, and hydroxylopeptide. Don't know what that does. We found the code to the basement. Well, we, I, found the code to the basement in the safe. It's 7441. And what did I find down there? Let me show you. It's actually quite weird. So you can also see the basement in this episode. I'm sorry, the game... Oh, this looks familiar. Threw me for a loop. Oh, let's say my recording software threw me for a loop. God damn it, still don't know how to open doors. That's the first floor. I don't waste want to waste too much time with showing you guys these things. Well, I'm quite sure I won't be able to find the basement units. Unit 28. Come on, open. There we go. Here's the basement. There we go. So you can see. Does look creepy, but it's not too bad. Now I did forget where the unit 28 is. It's not it's not down here, that's 30. Could be on the other side. No, that's 31. It's nowhere near these units. You would think that. But there it is. And you can already hear that. There are pig noises. Oh, Clay's a fear pretty good game. It's because whoever runs this whole operation has a piggy! Oh, would you look at that? I think I can do this stuff again. If I reboot, the sedation program should resume. Or I could unplug it. Put it out of its misery. Oh, so I can do it again. Earlier I decided to restart the whole thing. Thinking whoever's running this thing may be mad at me for doing so and fuck us up later. I think I'll do the same again. I mean, it is a misery quite clearly. But I'm a policeman. I can help it later. Once I get out of here. Yeah, that's all. pretty much all I did. The last two episodes I got lost down here. Pretty much like I'm being lost right now. I don't think I can go through this. Oh, I can! 
Okay. That didn't work earlier. Probably because I progressed. Yeah, we found this weird room. I think we can listen to the tape here. Hello, young man. I'm Dr. Landis. Do you know why you're here? You look like a big marshmallow. The ah, yes, the suit. I'm afraid it's necessary. Do you know why? Because you're scared of me. Okay. Oh. More implants. Uh, that's pretty much all we find down here. There's a creepy room here. The computer here only has emails with the tenant of this unit saying that he's getting the fuck out of Dodge because someone's after him. Yeah, that's that. I don't want to waste any more time. We had a little chat with Anus. He told us that the guy who's running the tattoo parlor lives in apartment 2010. I think 2010. I can check my log. Yeah, it's 2010. Uh, I'll just have to get back top side. I think we came this way. Hello, phone. Nice of you to join us. There we go. Uh, lots of fun has been had. I wasn't jump scared. I promise. So... You really didn't miss out on much. Oh, look, there's the rose again. Okay. Let's head up to the second story. Is it called story? Yeah. Second story of the building? I, I have no clue. I have to get to 2010. Oh, maybe that's why I heard footsteps earlier outside. Maybe the guy was running away. 2010, 211. That's where we have to go. Come on, open. Open. There we go. Hello, it's me, the Where's 2010? Okay. Uh, anything else around here? Hello. Dan Lazarski, KPD. Just need to ask you a few questions. You have reached the road. Have you noticed anything suspicious lately? Yeah. Strange anything suspicious lately? Strange noticed anything suspicious lately? Strange types in the hallway? That sort of thing. I did not. Master told me not to snoop. Snoop? I like to snoop. You're a robot, huh? You're not a bot, are you? Yes. Femcom 6.0. Cool. A sex bot. <laughs> that is an acceptable colloquialism. If Master Rossack isn't home, Rossack. why didn't he turn you off? I was deactivated following the afternoon session. My CPU rebooted spontaneously Re five hours and 43 seconds later. She rebooted? The lockdown must have interfered with your power slot. Okay. I'd say goodbye, but I guess there's no point. Yeah. Because that would humanize me. Yeah. What did you say? Please feel free to use me. <sighs> okay. I'm just kidding. Lots of crazy stuff going on here. Some night vision stuff going on here. Whatever the use of that is. Now let's move on. Don't think I have to go to the third floor yet. That's a creepy smile. Okay. Yeah, Dan previously tripped out a little bit. I think he's feeling guilty for something that happened to his wife. I don't know. I'm not here to judge. Come on, open. God fucking damn it. Open! Oh. It's like a lunch hall. A community kitchen, that's how you call it, I think. Pierogi. That looks delicious. What just happened? Okay, snooping around. Oh, there's another patient card. Christian Varsavsky. Pigeon Whisperer. That's a great uh, occupation. There we go. I don't think there's anything else of interest here. 
Nope. Nope. Can I? Ooh. Bigosh, I don't know that. Pomidorova, probably something with tomatoes. Golonka. That looks like hard. Probably pig hard. Shabovi, that looks like schnitzel. Just saying. Uh, this again. I want some schnitzel, please. Where's my schnitzel? No schnitzel for me. Okay. I know, I'm fucking around, wasting your time. Chiron is problem, not solution. Yeah, I read that in the basement too. Nothing of interest here. Just a bunch of flies. Nanophage and I, okay, cool. Okay. Nothing of interest here, I guess. Scanners aren't picking up anything either. There we go. Okay, let's check out apartment 10210. Be on our merry way. Hello? Anyone home? I bet there's another buddy somewhere around here. Probably not. Ooh, more synchrosine. Give me that. I need the synchro stuff. Thank you. Thanks a bunch. Whoa! I think Dana was tripping out again. Yeah, that happened before. Kinda. Ooh, scary. What the shit? Mm -hmm. Stop that noise. Thank you. Oh no, I'm... I'm trapped. What am I supposed to do? Mm. Earlier we saw a layer of fear poster. Now there's a... I don't know what it's called. A drawing thingy. Okay, I can't use my special visions. Maybe I have to look at something specific. Hmm. Hmm. Okay, it goes in here. Dan, a little help. No, keep, keep turning it. Maybe there's more. Why specialize in augmentation? To go beyond our limits. To realize our true potential. To usher in a new era. Okay. Big words. Some would say it's all about improving the patient's quality of life. Oh. Dude, what is that? What? Okay, let's go deeper. Where is that fucking bastard? What the hell? Hello. Still can't leave, apparently. Okay, I think I'll call it quits here for today. And I see you guys <laughs> in the next episode. Sheesh. Why the hell am I back in the basement? Oh, I'm just losing my mind again. <laughs>